Okay, so here we have a um, vegetable oil filtration system. This is drum number one here. The oil goes into here, and this is just a flower pot with the bottom cut off and silicon in round here. It's a 400 micron filter just to take out all the major stuff. We've got a site level down the side, and you can see the level of oil that we've got in there at the moment. This is just a crud drain for draining off uh, water and heavy fats and whatnot, that sort of thing that we don't want to go through the system. This is on a hinge, hinge round here, so you can open it up and you can see what's inside. There is also, you can't, maybe you can just see it back there, this item here which is an immersion heater. Um, and that is powered off this plug here so we can just switch this and it goes on there um, so where do we go from here well we open this valve here and we can check the quality of the oil if we open this one here if we want to run it through the system open this one and then we switch the pump on it comes down here and it'll, you'll open this one and it'll go left up here all the way up along here and then up to this filter here which is a 250 micron filter through to this one here which is 80 microns and then the next one which is 30 microns then what it does down the white pipe and into the second drum and it sits here for a wee bit longer same thing, sight level on it. Um, it's got an immersion heater around the back as well. You can maybe just see that in there, yep. And we can switch that on and heat it up, drive off the water and that sort of thing. Same as other drum, we've got a crud drain here. We can drain the stuff off. Um, and we want to actually pump it. Open these valves here. Again, we can test the quality with this one here if we want. Open the valves. And then if we drive it down onto the pump again, now instead of going left here, it will go right up the white pipe into this filter here, which is 20 microns, and then through a 5 micron filter, and then into this hose pipe, which I'll take out to the car, and on the end it's got this gun, which we can actually put it into the car. And that is that.